Hi, fifth and sixth grade. Today and tomorrow, we're going to be talking about poems. So today, we're just going to introduce some of the types of poems. All right, here we go. Let's get started. These are some of the more popular ones. So the first one is acrostic poem, and I'm sure you have all done one of these. An acrostic poem is a poem in which the first letters of each line spell out a word or phrase vertically. So you could have spring written down the side, and then you would start it with spring chickens start to chirp. Okay, and then you would say, I, insects start to come out, or something like that. Rhyming is a poem that uses rhymes. Pretty easy, huh? Like hickory dickory dock, the mouse went up the clock, the clock struck one, the mouse ran down, hickory dickory dock. Okay, a limerick is a humorous five-line poem with an A, A, B, B, A rhyming scheme. So what that means is that the first line and the second line would have to rhyme the last, le the last word. Then the next two lines would have to rhyme. And then the last line has to rhyme with the first two lines that you started. So that's what the rhyming scheme looks like. Okay, limericks are kind of fun to write too. A color poem is a poem that uses color to express feelings. Okay, you talk about how you're feeling and you use a poem. So if you're feeling blue, you might use the color blue because blue usually means sad. Okay, those are four types of poems. Now let's come on to the next couple types that I have. Haiku, you've probably written a haiku poem before. It's a three-line poem with a total of 17 syllables. The first and last lines have five syllables in them, and the middle has seven syllables in it. Okay. Now this one looks a little tricky and it's hard to spell. So if you see an I, an E, I, or a Y, after a C, it says the S sound. So this is Sin Cain poem. It's a five line poem. The first and the last lines have only two syllables, but in it often tells a story. You might not have written one of these yet and that's okay. An ABC poem. Each line begins with the letter of the alphabet. Pretty exclamatory, huh? First line starts with A, next line starts with B, C, D, E, and F until you get all the way through the alphabet and you're writing that poem, okay? And the last one that I'm gonna talk about today is a shape poem. A shape poem is a poem that describes an object, but it's written in the shape of that object. So if I wanted to describe an apple, my poem would be written in the shape of an apple. Okay, and just know that these are not all of the types of poetry, and that's okay. There's lots of different poetry out there, but these are some of the more popular ones that you might hear about. So today, my friends, I want to challenge you. I want you to write a poem. Write me a poem. It could be a haiku. It could be a cinquain. It could be an ABC, a shape poem. It could also be one of these. And acrostic poems, those are fun. A rhyming poem or a limerick or a color poem or another type of poem. Any type of poem that you want, I want you to practice writing that out today. If you write them out, I'd love to see them. Drop them in the comments below. All right, friends, until we meet tomorrow, bye.